as real estate development gone back to Lagos mainland? This is a question I tend to ask myself sometimes. Um, but the truth is, development never left Lagos mainland. We were so much carried away by the newfound lands in Ibejuleki and Epe to the point that we lost track of the developmental strides happening on Lagos mainland, most especially in key areas like Yaba, Maryland, and Ikeja. For everyone who is deliberate about cash flow in real estate in Lagos, Nigeria, you must not overlook the events and the developments happening on the mainland, most especially in these three key locations of Yaba, Maryland and Ikeja. We all know that Lagos mainland is the hub of residential development in Lagos, Nigeria. And this is because Lagos mainland houses the greater number of population. It is more populated than Lagos Island. You have more people living on the mainland than on the island. Right now, we experience housing deficits in Nigeria and Lagos in particular because every day the state keeps recording constant migration of people in thousands into the state. So, the residential development that already exists no longer is able to cater for everybody coming into the state. And recently, about two weeks ago, I went around uh, certain areas of Lagos mainland. Uh, in the coming days, I will be creating content along those lines. I will be exposing the potentials that exist in major areas on Lagos mainland and how investors can make the most and invest for cash flow in these areas of Lagos mainland. Now, if you if you are very conversant with the events and um, uh, the developmental strides in um, these places in Lagos, you would notice one thing that you really find virgin lands or um, lands that are yet to be developed on the mainland. You really find them. What you would see are old houses that are being restructured and refurbished. Another thing you would notice is, most especially in areas like Yaba and Ikeja, you would notice that the restructuring is coming in the form of um, the development of um, apartments rather than duplexes or uh, bungalows. It is coming in the form of apartments. And this is because the rate at which people are looking for residential and rental development is so high it is so high so developers are building and um, developing residential development to cater for this high demand of rental developments in the state now what does this hold for smart investors for every smart investor deliberate about making cash flow in lagos you must look at investing in residential development on the mainland, not on the island, on the mainland. This is because the demand is there and the population to stay in those places is already available. All that is needed is for developers and owners of houses to create and develop housing units to cater for this rental source that is being experienced in the state. What you notice is that people are building more of apartments, and this is because the demand for rental development and also short let is so great, most especially in Ikeja. Short let, the demand for short let is so high in Ikeja, Maryland, and Yaba, and this is because they are very strategic. For Maryland, you understand that it is very close to uh, key places in Lagos, very close to Ikeja, and very accessible to different parts of the state. For Yaba, you will understand that it has so much history when it comes to uh, um, the educational sector. Most tertiary institutions in Lagos are situated in Yaba. In Yaba alone, you have more than, I think, about five tertiary institutions. So you notice that the demography of Yaba is populated by the young youth. This is because all the institutions that are clustered in this area of Lagos. Not just that, Yaba is a tech hub of Nigeria. 
the Silicon Valley of Nigeria. And that is why you will see that it thrives so much in not just residential development, but also in commercial development. And the demand for shortlets in Yaba right now is so great because most of these tech guys come into the state from different countries and they are looking for places they will stay for a short time, for short rest. And shortlet is what they demand for instead of an hotel because that gives them more flexibility to do their work and have access to key areas that uh, relate to tech in um, that part of Lagos, Nigeria. So, um, anyone looking to invest in Yaba right now should be looking to buy or develop apartments suitable for rent and also for shortlet. In this way, you make so much money. Also, the same thing applies to um, Ikeja, Lagos, Nigeria. Ikeja is where the seat of power is. And it is home to the international airport. So you see reasons why uh, short leg thrives in this part of Lagos. Home to international airport and home to so many governmental and business headquarters. So you will see so many tourists coming into the state. They land in Ikeja and they look for uh, short leg development in those areas. So for Lagos Mainland as a whole, we are experiencing so much deficit when it comes to residential development now what developers are doing right now is to develop apartments and put them out for sale this is a catch for smart investors if you're looking to own a development that will guarantee you a constant cash flow in the form of rent and a short list, then you look to buy an apartment either in yaba maryland or ikeja because this is where the demand is and this is where the juice is for residential and shortlet development. You look to buy an apartment there and you can be rest assured that your apartment would always be in high demand because these areas are very strategic. The demand is there, the population is there and the need also is already existing. So it is not a case of um, you buy a house and start looking for those that will rent the place. No, before you even build, before you even finish developing, people are already there to take your development. So smart investors, development has gone back to Lagos mainland. But if you're looking to own something that would guarantee you high returns on investment, look to own an apartment on the mainland, most especially in um, Yaba, Ikeja, and um, Maryland. I'll be introducing to some of these developments, off-plan developments that you should key into to make this constant cash flow. Right? If you're looking to make money in real estate, this is one opportunity for you um, to make this happen. So for more information on some of these developments on the mainland in Yaba, Ikeja and Maryland, my number is on the screen. For consultation, call me and I will advise you on how to go about this. I've got juicy offers for you. If you've been watching from the beginning, you'll see that I displayed some of them on the screen. Just call me to get more information on, on them and I'll send um, more details on those um, developments to you. Mainland is the juice for rental and short lead development. Look to owning an apartment on the mainland. This is because there is demand already and that is what every smart investors want. Until I see you again, stay safe, keep investing in real estate and peace.